This is the stage pass check-in. Hi everyone and welcome to day two of the D23 Expo. I am Anna today and the first thing we have is the Disney Studios panel but we have a stage pass for it so we didn't need to camp out overnight which is really good. It's about nearly about half past seven-ish and we're waiting in the line so hopefully we will get in soon. As you can see over there they have a concession stand for food for overnight. This is the stage pass line, about quarter to eight. Okay, so we are in another line now and we have a wristband. So we're gonna be waiting a while, but we're definitely getting in, so it's a lot less stressful than yesterday. With that being said, there is absolutely no recording, no photos, no video, no nothing. I apologize, it's gonna be ringed in your head. I have all my friendly team here that's gonna come around with these envelopes. The important piece of this is put your phone, your electronic, anything that turns on and off, laptops, cameras, everything will go inside this bag. Turn it off prior, you might as well just save your battery for the next few hours. Turned off, sealed by the time you get upstairs. We are going to be moving upstairs in a very short time. Uh, so by the time you get upstairs, have your phone in your bag, sealed again, sealed in your bag holding it up that will help this line move much quicker and get you to your seats as quickly as possible. Okay, so this is where I need to leave you now because I need to put away my phone, my camera, and I'm not allowed to use any of it to record the panel. So I'll see you guys after the panel and I'll let you know all the exciting announcements. This is the line to get the posters at the end of the panel. Very long. So we just got back from going to the panel. It was amazing. Did you like it? Yeah, it was really, really good. Two and a half hours went. So yeah, it went longer. The pros of it was incredible. They came out and they sang an amazing song all together. The that whole was cast. the finale. That was the finale, and then autumn leaves dropped from the front. Oh, it was so cute. And I've seen so many celebrities today. There's Christopher Bell. We saw Aquafina. We saw Emily Blunt. And we saw Tina Fey. Jonathan Brock, Josh Kent, there was just so many people, like I was overwhelmed with how many famous people there were on stage and I'm, I'm just so excited, we saw so many exclusive clips, the new Dragon movie looked great, yes, and onwards. the Onward stuff looked incredible, Mulan, amazing, I'm just really, really excited, so, oh, I can't wait for you guys to see these movies or to see the previews, I'm sure you'll be able to see some of them online already, but some of them are just exclusive for us, and oh, wow, I'm now we're queuing up for Frozen. Now we're we went to um, Mickey's at Glendale and I got a few things, specifically Epcot themed things, and now we're lining up for the frozen photo opportunity. We've had a very frozen day, you know, we're wearing this. So, see you soon. We finally found them! Just looking at the 
medals for Run Disney and they all look amazing. I mean, look at that Rapunzel one. Oh my gosh. And there's also an Olaf and Sven one over there that I really wanted to do, but I won't be able to get in. Oh, it's so cute. They showed a lot of the behind the his scenes videos, which was really cool to watch. After it though, I like sprinted to the Disney animation booth to get my Frozen 2 poster giveaway, and I literally got the last one. I was running through the expo in my ball gown, and it was really, really, really bad. But I got the poster, and that's all that matters. Anyway, we're at the Hilton right now, gonna get an Uber or Lyft or whatever we decide. It's a good way to get one without dealing with the chaos that is at the front of the D23 Expo at the end of the day. So that's what we're doing. We've got one more day left tomorrow with the parks panel. So watch that video for more content. <laughs> 